a van passed us that matched the description of which the individual, the perpetrators were in. And after a few blocks of following them, they knew we were back there and they gradually increased their speed to a point where it turned into a pursuit. But as we got close, as the car, the vehicle that I was driving got closer, we never let them out, we never, they never got out of our sight. And as I got closer, to the vehicle, that is when the, the perpetrators in the van we were pursuing started to uh, start shooting at us. I'm, I'm lying in my right eye. I have a prosthetic eye, and that, and I have limited mobility on my left arm and my left leg because my brain injury was on my right side of my brain, which controlled the left side of my body, which which took away some of my uh, mobility on my left side of my body. Since his disabling injury back in 1998, Officer Lloyd Todd spends most of his day confined to a small home located on Detroit's northeast side, where a full-time caregiver monitors his regimen of medication and daily needs. These are pills right here that I take for my for the gunshot wound I sustained to my head to prevent seizures because since I, I suffered a traumatic brain injury, I'll always be a candidate for seizures probably for the rest of my life. In spite of his daily hardships, the highly decorated officer rarely complains, and he still has dreams to fulfill, such as regaining his mobility so that someday he can spend some quality time with his nine-year-old son. I can't spend the time that I want to spend with them as a ch father and a child do. And my injury robbed me of a lot of time that, to spend with him. And things like that. If I had like a wheelchair, a motorized wheelchair that I can use, that I can spend time with him, uh, he, he, I'm sure he would probably uh, really enjoy it too because he can give me the time. It's nothing like seeing a child, your child's, the smile on your child's face when they spend the time to do, especially when the child is growing up. Because you will never see those kind of smiles again. Living Legends is working to fulfill that big dream.